bird. One of them could win thousands of pounds, but only if they know their lingo. Hello, welcome to Lingo, the game where the simplest of words can win you thousands of pounds. Let's meet today's teams. Emmett and Elvira, hello. Hello. Uh, so your son and mum. Yep. Yeah, lovely. Whereabouts are you from? Bedford. Bedford, very nice. Apparently you two have got telepathic powers. Is that right, Elvira? I mean, obviously we're mum and son, yeah. but um, you can be sure that whenever he's thinking about something, I'm thinking about the same thing at the time. I mean, the fact that mum knows what you're thinking, Emma, is that always a good thing? Uh, no, no, definitely <laughs> not. But, uh... <laughs> Emma and Elvira, you're going to be lots of fun. Thanks for joining us on Thank Lingo. You. Thank, Thank you. you. Charlie and Paul, hello. Hello. Uh, married? No. Oh, or, life or, partners. Or, <laughs> or could. Oh, could we do that again. Uh, Charlie and Paul, uh, a couple? <laughs> yes. Yeah. Good. Uh, where are you from? From uh, London. From London, yeah. Lovely. And Paul, your day job is is a little bit interesting. What do you do during the day? Yeah, well, I'm actually a, a lamppost inspector. Um, <laughs> checking the are lampposts you, are all safe. Are you, what is that? <laughs> well, we just go along, open them up, get get into the inner workings, make sure they're not going to fall down. Uh, I've not been doing it for that long, but right. uh, I think I've got a bright future. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and Charlie, apparently the both of you, you like going bird watching. We do, but we're not that great at sort of knowing what the birds are called. We oh, just hang on, we, we hang do... on. So you go bird watching, but you don't know the names of the birds. No. <laughs> How does that work? It's like, shh, there's another one. What is it? <laughs> it's a bird. <laughs> Charlie and Paul, like you already, thanks for joining us on Lingo. Eddie and Matt, hello. Hello Hi there. Father and son. That's right, yes. Uh, where are you from? We're from Wiltshire. Fantastic. And uh, Matt, you're a teacher by profession. That's correct, yes, I'm a primary school teacher. Fantastic. So you've got to be good with words. I think if I spell any words wrong today, my children will never let me live it down. <laughs> <laughs> and Eddie, you've got an English A-level. I do indeed, yeah. So in theory, I should be all right with words, but... We'll right. see, I guess. I think you two are going to be a great team. Eddie and Matt, thanks for joining thanks. us on thanks. Lingo. <laughs> so, teams, do you know your lingo? Here's how the game works. This is a lingo grid. Our contestants will be shown the first letter of a word. All they have to do is identify that word. For example, here they're looking for a five-letter lingo beginning with P. They might try purse. P-U-R-S-E. It's not purse, but if they correctly guess any letters in the right place, they turn green. Correct letters in the wrong place will turn yellow. Let's try the word prove. P-R-O-V-E. It's not prove, but the R is now in the right place. They have five attempts to solve each lingo, run out of time or give a word that's not in our approved dictionary. They lose the lingo. Each time they find a lingo, we'll add money to their bank. So that's the prize they're looking for. Aha. Uh -huh. Prize. P-R-I-Z-E. And that is a nice surprise. Now, the team with the most money after three rounds will play in the final for a chance to take home thousands of pounds. So, teams, in the first round, we are looking for four-letter lingos. You'll get three lingos, each worth 200 pounds. Do keep an eye on the timer, though. You'll only get 10 seconds per guess. Good luck to you all. Let's play Lingo. <laughs> now, Emmett and Elvira, you're up first. Do you know your lingo? Here we go. Your first four-letter lingo begins with the letter B, and your time starts now. Bash, B-A-S-H. Bash. Good start, A, eh? and in the right place. Bark, B-A-R-K. Bark. Bant, B-A-N-T. Bant, B-A-N-T. Band, B-A-N-D. Band. Good, very well played. In case you're wondering, the definition of bant is to tie with string. OK? Emma and Elvira, good start. £200, your second four-letter lingo begins with the letter M, and your time starts now. Monk, M-O-N-K. Monk, M-O-N-K. 
Moan. M O A N. Moan. M O A N. Mole. M O L E. Mole. M O L E. Well done. We got that. In. More. M O R E. More. One more go at this. Mode. M O D E. Mode. M O D E. Oh, it's not mode. Unlucky. Let's have a look. See what it is. Move. Never mind. That's... Never mind. Okay. Still plenty of time to play. Here comes your third and final four-letter lingo. It begins with the letter V, and your time starts now. Very. V E R Y. Very. V E R Y. It's not very. We've got the E. Vice. Vice. B I C E. Well done. One more letter required. V I D uh, Vide. V I D E. V I D E. Vibe. V I B E. Vibe. Have we got the vibe? Oh, one more. Vile. V I L E. Vile. Yes. Well done. <laughs> hey. <laughs> I love that, Emma and Elvira. Very well done, £400. In the game, I've spotted sort of Elvira looking at Emma, and I'm trying to think, is this, is this telepathy? In, it's in happening, actual... it's happening. You're looking going, no, he's not thinking of anything, I'll do it. <laughs> no, he hasn't got anything, I'll do it. I love that. And the word vidi means, look, it's now time for you to win a bonus £300 with your puzzle word. In this round, your puzzle word is 10 letters. We'll give you a cryptic clue and then show you the first letter. You'll have just 10 seconds to find the answer. As the time ticks down, we'll reveal more letters, but the money will drop in value. Buzz in when you know the answer to the puzzle word. OK? Fingers on your buzzers. Here we go. And here comes your clue. This answer is full of swings and roundabouts. This answer is full of swings and roundabouts. Your time starts now. Playground. You've got to press your buzzer. Playground. Playground. Jeez. Playground for £220. Let's have a look. Well done. <laughs> High five all round. £620 to Emma and Elvira. Very good start. Charlie and Paul, do you know your lingo? Here we go. Your first four-letter lingo begins with the letter G. And your time starts now. Guts. G-U-T-S. Guts. Gate. G-A-T-E. Gate. Got an A and a T not in the right place. Time's running out. Gore. G-O-R-E. Gore. G-O-R-E. Keeps you in the game. Well done. Goat. Goat. G-O-A-T. Goat. <laughs> Yay! Very good. £200. Well done. Here we go. Your second four-letter lingo begins with the letter N, and your time starts now. Nose. N-O-S-E. Nose. Good. E in the right place. Keep an eye on the timer. Oh, gosh, I don't know. Nate, N-A-T-E. Nate, N-A-T-E. Is that a word? It's not a word, I'm afraid. Let's have a look and see what it is. Name. Oh, Surely one letter out. Name. It's so difficult. Only one letter out, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> OK, your final four-letter lingo begins with the letter W and your time starts now. West. W-E-S-T. West. Good. T, and in the right place. Wait. W-A-I-T. Wait. Good. Want, W-A-N-T. We want this to be right. It is right. Well done. £400. Now it's time for your puzzle word. We're going to give you a ten-letter word and we'll give you ten seconds to answer. Fingers on your buzzers. Here's your clue. This answer put a ring on it. This answer put a ring on it. Your time starts now. E. A. Engagement. If this is engagement, it's two hundred and twenty pounds to Charlie and Paul. Let's have a look. It is engagement. Fantastic. <laughs> oh, dead level now with Emmett and Elvira. Six hundred and twenty pounds. This could be a very, very close game. 
Eddie and Matt, no pressure. You know what the standard is now? Tough act to follow, this. <laughs> I reckon you can do it. Here we go. Eddie and Matt, here comes your first four-letter lingo. It begins with the letter H, and your time starts now. Hair, H-A-I-R. Hair. Good start. Um, hats, H-A-T-S. Hats. Keep it hand, H-A-N-D. Hand. It's not hand. Two more attempts. Uh, hair, H-A-R-E. Hair, H-A-R-E. Well done, you got an E and in the right place. One more letter. Hate. Time's running out. Hate, H-A-T-E. No, Have a look. Is it hate? We've already had the T. Couldn't be hate. Let's have a look and see what it is. Have. It's have. Unlucky. Still plenty of time in this game. Here comes your second four-letter lingo. It begins with the letter S, and your time starts now. Sand, S-A-N-D. Sand. Well done. N, and in the right place. Scent, S-E-N-T. Scent. Good. Very good. Right, £200. It's time for your third and final four-letter lingo. It begins with the letter C, and your time starts now. Cave, C-A-V-E. Cave. Uh, keep an eye on the timer. Core, C-O-R-E. Core. It's not core. Chip, C-H-I-P. Chip. Not chip. Two more attempts. Colt, C-U-L-T. Colt. Uh, well done, you've got a U. Is... And you've got a T. Cuts, you think? Uh, yeah. uh, cuts C U T S. Cuts C U T S. Oh, well done. Very well played. Oof. Worried about your one point there, but you got there in the end. Four hundred pounds. Following exactly the same pattern as our other teams here, and now it's time for your puzzle word. Three hundred pounds. Fingers on your buzzers. Here comes your clue. This answer. Does the dirty work for you? This answer does the dirty work for you. Your time starts now. Dishwasher. Dishwasher. Dishwasher for £260. This will take you into the lead if this is right. Let's have a look. Yes. It is dishwasher. Well done. In the lead, but only just £660. So, at the end of that round, Emmett and Elvira, £620. Level with Charlie and Paul, also with £620. And out in front, but by the smallest of margins, Eddie and Matt with £660. Well done. <laughs> now, in the next round, we'll be playing five-letter lingos. There's even more money to be won, and the teams get to steal. However, the team with the lowest total at the end of the round will be eliminated. Join us in a mo, right here on Lingo. <laughs> Welcome back to Lingo, the show where if you put in a good word, you could walk away with thousands of pounds. It's now time for round two. Now then, teams, in this round, we're looking for five-letter lingos. As before, each team will get three lingos, but this time, each correct answer is worth £300. However, if you run out of time or play a word that is not in our dictionary, the lingo grid will flash red and your opponents can jump in and steal. So keep your fingers on the buzzers. And remember, if you see red, you can steal. The end of this round will spell disaster for one team because the pair with the lowest amount will be eliminated. Let's play Lingo. <laughs> Emmett and Elvira, here we go. Your first five-letter Lingo begins with the letter A and your time starts now. Angle, A-N-G-L-E. Angle. Is it a good angle? Found an L, well done. Alien, A-L-L-I-E-N. Alien. L now in the right place, good. Alarm. A-L-A-R-M. Raise that alarm. Oh, hello. 
Hello. Look at that. I'm loving the face as well. <laughs> the poker face afterwards. <laughs> I'm not going to tell you I'm chuffed with that. <laughs> this is what I always do. Brilliant. I'm loving the confidence, Elvira. Here we go. Your second five-letter lingo begins with the letter F, and your time starts now. Fright. F-I-R-I-G-H. You've given us five letters. We have to accept that as your answer. <laughs> Who's going to steal? Anybody? Eddie and Matt. Uh, flame. F-L-A-M-E. It's worth a go. It's not flame. Charlie and Paul could steal here. Time's running out. Paul. Faith. F-A-I-T-H. Got to have faith. Oh, unlucky. Wasn't faith. Everyone had a go at that. Let's have a look and see what it is. Fairy. Fairy. Never mind. Emmett and Elvira, it's time for your third and final five-letter lingo. And it begins with the letter V, and your time starts now. Venus. V-E-N-U-S. Venus. Good. E and an S, and E's in the right place. Verse. V-E-R-S-E. Verse. Is it the right verse? It is. Well done. Very well played. I'm loving that face. <laughs> £1,220 to Emmett and Elvira. Very good round so far. Now it's time for your puzzle word, which is now 11 letters long, but the money is worth £400. If you buzz in and give us a correct answer, the money is all yours. But if you buzz in and give us an incorrect answer, your opponents can steal, OK? Fingers on your buzzers. Here's your clue. This answer takes the biscuit. This answer takes the biscuit. And your time starts now. G. B. D. A. R. Gingerbread. If it's gingerbread, it goes green. If it's wrong, it goes red. Other teams can steal. Let's have a look. It is gingerbread. Well done. £100. £1,320, definitely worth a high five, that. Great total at the end of that round for you guys. <sighs> Whoo, Charlie and Paul, you know what you've got to do. Here's your first five-letter lingo. Begins with the letter N, and your time starts now. Night, N-I-G-H-T. Night. Good. Nasty, N-A-S-T-Y. Nasty. <laughs> oh, hello. <laughs> Someone's getting nasty now. <laughs> £920. Very, very good start. Here we go. Here comes your next five-letter lingo. And it begins with the letter W. And time starts now. Water. W-A-T-E-R. Water. Good start. Time's running out. Waits. W-A-I-T-S. Waits. Keeps you in the game. You found an I and the T now in the right place. Time's running out. Someone could steal. Um, with w Oh, out of time. Who's going to steal? Eddie and Matt. White. W-H-I-T-E. Is it white? Yes. It is white. Well done. Very good steal. £960. Charlie and Paul, don't worry. Plenty of time. Here comes your... Final five-letter lingo begins with the letter I, and your time starts now. Igloo. I-G-L-O-O. -O. Igloo. It's not igloo. Idiot. I-D-I-O-T. Idiot. Oh, gosh. It's not idiot. Three Inner. I-N-N-E-R. Inner. Found an E. Time's running out. Irate, I-R-A-T-E. Just in time, irate. Good, E now in the right place. Your last attempt, other teams could steal. Seconds left. Anyone gonna steal? Buzz in. Emmett and Elvira. Idol, I-D-D-L-E. Idol, I-D-D-L-E, is that a word? I don't think it is. 
Eddie and Matt can still steal. Imbue, I-M-B-U-E. Imbue. It's not imbue, but you've found a U. Unlucky. Let's see what it is. Issue. 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 And imbue, Matt, brilliant word. It means to inspire with. So, Charlie and Paul, £920. £400 behind Emmett and Elvira, but you could make that up now with your puzzle word. Fingers on your buzzers. Here is your clue. This answer is better than the last one. This answer is better than the last one. Your time starts now. I. Yes, Charlie and Paul. Improvement. If this is right, it will go green. If it's wrong, it goes red. Other teams can steal. This answer is better than the last one. Let's take a look. It is improvement. Well done. You did exactly what you needed to do. That is very classy indeed. Charlie and Paul, up to £1,320. This game couldn't be any closer. And Eddie and Matt, at this stage in round one, you managed to get ahead. Can you do the same now? Here we go. Your first five-letter lingo, try and get you back in the lead, begins with the letter M and your time starts now. Mouse, M-O-U-S-E. Mouse, M-O-U-S-E. Oh, oh. Mouth, M-O-U-T-H. Mouth. Good, well done. Good really good start. Takes you to £1,260, giving you a good chance of restoring your lead now. Here we go with your second five-letter lingo. It begins with the letter R and your time starts now. Right, R-I-G-H-T. Right, R-I-G-H-T. Uh, found a G. Regal, R-E-G-A-L. Oh, uh, we like Regal. It's not Regal. Time's ticking. Other teams could steal. Rough, R-O-U-G-H. Rough. It's not rough, but you've found a U. Time's running out. Right, R-I-G-H-T. Right, oh. but already had right, so we can't accept that. Any other team going to steal? Emmett and Elvira. Rogue, R-O-G-U-E. Rogue, is it rogue? It's not rogue. Charlie and Paul, you've got a chance to steal. Just a few seconds left. Is it worth a go? Out of time. Let's have a look and see what it is. Rugby. Uh -huh. Rugby. Oh, of course it was rugby. <laughs> Wrong shaped ball. <laughs> <laughs> Eddie and Matt, £1,260 so far. You'll need to get something from this to get yourself back in the lead. Here we go. Your final five-letter lingo begins with the letter O and your time starts now. Other, O-T-H-E-R. Other, O-T-H-E-R. Well done, R, and in the right place. Uh, offer, O-F-F-E-R. Offer, O-F-F-E-R. Older, O-L-D-E-R. Older, O-L-D-E-R. Time's running out. Other teams could steal. Outer, O-U-T-E-R. Outer, just in time. Is it outer? It's not outer. One more attempt. Time's running out. Ought, O-U-G-H-T. Ought, O-U-G-H-T. It's not ought. Who's going to steal? Time's running out. Oh! No one got in there in time. Let's have a look, see what it is. Come occur. On. Didn't occur to anybody at the time, though, did it? <laughs> Never mind, Eddie and Matt, 1,260. You are still behind. You need to get something from this puzzle word to give you a chance of being in the head-to-head. -head. Here comes your puzzle word. This answer has betrayed us. This answer has betrayed us. Your time starts now. £340. Yes, Eddie and Matt. Treacherous. 
treacherous. This answer has betrayed us. If it's treacherous, it'll go green, £280 to you. If it's wrong, it goes red and other teams can steal. Let's have a look. Treacherous. Oh, well done. That was a very good puzzle word, a very good word to get. Takes you to £1,540, which means we are definitely seeing you in the head-to-head. -head. You've restored your lead. Very well played. So, we have a tie-break, which means Emmett and Elvira and Charlie and Paul will now play an 11-letter puzzle word. A correct answer means you go through to the next round. However, if you buzz in and give us a wrong answer, you will be eliminated. So here we go. Fingers on your buzzers. Here is your clue for a place in the head-to-head. -head. Take in your surroundings. Take in your surroundings. Your time starts now. E. Environment. Emmett and Elvira, environment. If this is right, we'll see you in the head-to-head -head lingo battle. Take in your surroundings. Let's take a look. It is environment. <laughs> <laughs> very, very well played. Oh, that was a really good early answer. Emmett and Elvira, congratulations. We'll see you in the head-to-head. How are you feeling? Great. <laughs> Raring to go. Oh, I'll tell you what, Eddie and Matt, you better be ready for these two. <laughs> Charlie and Paul, unlucky. That was terribly close. On this occasion, it leaves me with just one word to say, and that's goodbye. It looks like it's back to the lamppost. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Uh, lovely. Thank you so much. Our remaining two teams will now go head-to-head -head in the lingo battle. Only one of them can reach the final, with the chance to win thousands of pounds. Who will have the last word? Find out in a moment, here on Lingo. <laughs> you know, you would have been out, but you got in there really early, you just went for it, really confident, well played. Eddie and Matt, you've done everything that's been required of you. You're doing well under pressure, Eddie. It's a close game, but hopefully we can stay ahead. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. Right, round three is the Lingo battle. In this round, you'll play individually against a member of the opposing team. One of you will play four-letter lingos and the other will play five-letter lingos. Now, if you fail to solve the lingo, control will pass over to your opponent, who then gets the chance to play all the remaining lines on the grid. Now, in this round, time is money, as the lingos are worth more the faster they are sold. Getting it on your first guess will bank you £500, second guess 450 then 400 and 350 until your final guess, which is worth £300. So, who's playing four, who's playing five? Should I go for the fives? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What have you decided, Elvira? Emmett's going to be playing the four. OK. I play the five. A any reason for that? Well, I've been practising more on the five-letter words. OK. Yeah. Good. That makes sense. Mm -hmm. All right. And Eddie and Matt, how have you come to your decision? Eddie knows quite a lot of four-letter words, so I'm going to stick with the fives. Right, OK. <laughs> I'm going to ask you which four-letter words <laughs> you know, Eddie. It's not that kind of show. But anyway. <laughs> <laughs> right. Take your positions. Let's play lingo. <laughs> Emmett, you are slightly behind, so you will go first. Here comes your first four-letter lingo. It begins with the letter P, and your time starts now. Pint, P-I-N-T. Pint. It's not pint. Push, P-U-S-H. Push. Poke, P-O-K-E. Oh, well done. Poke, P-O-K-E. Takes you to £1,720. Emmett, uh, in terms of poke, uh, we judge that you were generally correcting your spelling, which, of course, is allowed in the rules of the game. OK, so, Eddie, you are up next. Here's your first four-letter lingo. It begins with the letter I, and your time starts now. Into, I-N-T-O. Into. It's not into, but you found a T. Time's running out. Emmett, you could steal here. Control to Emmett. Um, it's 
Time's running out. Oh, out of time. Let's have a look, see what the answer was. Itch. Itch. Never mind. Emma and Elvira lead with £1,720. Eddie and Matt, £1,540. It's a very close battle. Emma, here comes your second four-letter lingo. It begins with the letter L, and your time starts now. Load, L-O-A-D. Load, L-O-A-D. Oh! <laughs> Loaded very nicely there. I'll tell you what, Alvira still poker face behind. She's not trying to get too excited here. <laughs> very well played. Two thousand two hundred twenty pounds. Eddie. Yeah. You know what you got to do, yeah. don't you? Yeah. Okay. Here we go. Your second and final four-letter lingo begins with the letter D, and your time starts now. Doll. D O L L. Doll. Good start. Done. D O N E. Is that done? <laughs> Time's running out. Dope. D O P E. Dope. Is that a dope answer? It's not. Two more attempts. You could be in here, Emmett. Doc. D O C K. Doc. Good. Very good. Needed that. Takes you to £1,890. Again, very close now. Emmett and Eddie, it is time for your puzzle word, which is now a 12 letter word worth up to £750. Here is your clue. You say one thing, then do another. You say one thing, then do another. Your time starts now. H. C. T. O. I. Oh, Eddie and Matt's. Go on, Eddie. Hi uh, hypocrite. If this is hypocrite, it'll go green. The money's to you. If it's red, it goes over to Emma to get a chance to bank some money. <sighs> ah, I'm afraid not enough time for you, Emmett. Let's have a look and see what it is. <laughs> Hypocritical. Eddie and Matt, £1,890. Emmett and Elvira just ahead, £2,220. A very close battle so far. It's now time for the five-letter lingo battle. Please swap positions. <laughs> Matt, you're currently behind, so you will play first. Okay. Here's your first five-letter lingo. Begins with the letter T, and your time starts now. There, T-H-E-I-R. There, T-H-E-I-R. It's not there, but you've got a H and it's in the right place. Uh, those, T-H-O-S-E. Those. Uh, thank, T-H-A-N-K. Thank. It's not thank. Uh, thumb, T-H-U-M-B. Thumb. Good, well done. Worked out what letters weren't there for £350. Takes you to £2,240 back in the lead. Well done. Elvira, pressure on you now with your first five-letter lingo. It begins with the letter E, and your time starts now. Eight, the number eight, E-I-G-H-T. Eight. £450. Um, eager, E-A-G-E-R. Eager for this to be the right answer. Good. Found an A, E and R. Not in the right place. Time's running out. £400. Erase. E-A-E-R-A-S-E. -E. Erase. E-R-A-S-E. -E. Well done. Very well played. Oh, this is turning out to be a classic. Emmett and Elvira, up to £2,620. Matt, you were in the lead, but not for very long. No. Elvira is playing a blinder. You've fallen behind before and you've come back in the lead. So, Matt, you can do this again. Here comes your second and final five-letter lingo. It begins with the letter B and your time starts now. Bound. B-O-U-N-D. This is bound to be right. It's not. Uh, beats. B-E-A-T-S. Beats. Good. T, and in the right place. Three more attempts. £400. Uh, 
Time's running out. Butch, B-U-T-C-H. Just in time. B-U-T-C-H. Well done. H, and in the right place. Time's running out. Uh, breathe. Uh, B R E. Oh, over to you, Elvira. Now, Wonga. Breath. This. B R E A T H. B R E A T H. It says that's a six letter word. We're looking for five oh, letters, of course. Never mind. Let's have a look and see what it is. Birth. 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 Whew, still very, very close, all of this. Emmett Elvira, £2,620. Eddie and Matt, £2,240. It's time for your final five-letter lingo, Elvira. Begins with the letter C, and your time starts now. Clock. C-L-O-C-K. Clock. C-L-O-C-K. It's not clock. Cold. C-O-L-D-S. Colds. C-O-L-D-S. It's not cold. Down to £400. Time is ticking. Matt, you are... Crail. C-R-A-I-L. Crail. Is that a word? It's not a word. Control over to Matt. You don't need to buzz. You can just give us your answer. Uh, civil. C-I-V-I-L. Civil. It's not civil. One more guess for £300. Time's running out. Oh. oh, out of time. Oof. Oh, dear. Let's have a look and see what it is. Crawl. So close, so close. You could have really given yourself a good chance there, Matt. But it's still not over. So it's now down to the puzzle word to see who will be in the final of lingo. This puzzle word is worth £750. You are playing for a place in the final. Fingers on your buzzers. Here's your clue. The suspense is killing me. Too right. The suspense is killing me. Your time starts now. A. Another A. £360. I. I. Oh. Emmett and Alvira. Anticipation. If this is anticipation, it will go green, and that means it's right, and we'll be seeing you through to the final. Let's have a look. Anticipation. <laughs> it is anticipation. <laughs> 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 Do the little bit of a dance. Well done. Come and join your partners. Oh, Emma and Elvira, what a game you've played. £2,720. It's been one of the closest games we've had. Elvira, how do you feel? Elated. Well, very good. We'll be seeing you in the final. Eddie and Matt, you have played so well, really. I mean, you've been leading at times, yeah. but just when it came to it, in the end... Uh, Emma and Elvira have been fantastic. They've been oh. really, really uh, yeah. tough competitors, so well, well done to them. Listen, Eddie and Matt, leaves me with just one word to say, and that's goodbye. Bye, see you later. See you later. <laughs> 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 Love it. It's keen to leave, isn't he? <laughs> Emmett and Elvira are through to the final round where they'll have the chance to double their money. Can they lingo all the way? We'll see you in a bit. Welcome back to Lingo, where Emmett and Elvira have made it through to today's final. I mean, how do you guys feel? I mean, you've done so well. I mean, it's been one of the closest games we've had on Lingo. When you started, Emmett, did you think you'd be here? Uh, no, not quite, but <laughs> hey, here I am, so... <laughs> Elvira, what do you think it is? Why do you think you've managed to fight off the other two teams today? Because I've put in all the efforts. I've been working very hard. Good. Whenever you work hard, it pays off. Well, you know what? Let's hope it really does pay off for you now. So, look, here's the thing. Although you have banked £2,720, it really means nothing at the moment because you're not going home with a penny of it. But all that can change right now. In this final round, there will be 90 seconds on the clock. If you can solve one four-letter lingo, you'll win half of the money you've banked today. That's £1,360. If you can solve a four-letter lingo 
and a five letter lingo will give you all the money you bank today, which is 2,720 pounds. That's pretty good, but we could do better than that. If you can solve a four letter lingo, a five letter lingo, and a six letter lingo, all in 90 seconds, will double your money so you'll be going home with £5,440. If you were to win that kind of money, Elvira, what would you do with it? Um, well, I'm looking forward to doing my PhD. I've Brilliant. just completed a master's degree. Brilliant. Some of that money will go towards paying for my PhD. And, I mean, if there's any money left over, <laughs> after mum's gone and got a PhD, uh, what would you want? I'd probably put it towards a car because I'm learning to drive. Well, let's hope you can do that. Here we go. As it's the final, there is no time limit on your guesses. If you give a word that is not in our dictionary, you'll be given a new lingo. And if you're completely stuck, just say pass and we'll replace the word with another one, okay? For the final time, Emmett and Elvira, let's play lingo. <laughs> Whew, right. Here comes your final four letter lingo for 1,360 pounds. 90 seconds on the clock. Your four letter lingo begins with the letter A and your time starts now. Ain't, A-I-N-T. Ain't, A-I-N-T, is that a word? It's not a word, what is it? A jar, new word. Puff, P-U-F-F. -F. Puff, P-U-F-F. -F. Pass, P-A-S-S. Pass, P-A-S-S. -S. Pint, P-I-N-T. Pint, P-I-N-T. P You've got a T, 67 seconds. Part, P-R-A-R-T. Part. It's not part, one more go. 58 seconds. Pass, pass. Pass, new word, what was it? Plot, new word. R. Road, R-O-A-D. Is this the right road? It's not road. Ring, R-I-N-G. Ring, R-I-N-G. Rear, R-E-A-R. Rear, R-E-A-R. E, but not in the right place. 34 seconds. Reef, R-A-E-F. Reef, R-A-E-F. Is that a word? It's not a word. What is it? Rule, new word. F. Fuel, F-U-E-L. Fuel, F-U-E-L. 20 seconds. Fair, F-A-R-E. Fair, F-A-R-E. R in the right place. Two more letters, 12 seconds. 10 seconds. Four, F, F, U, R, R. F, O, R, E, F, O, R, E. It's not for F, U, F, Four, F, O, R, E. Four, F, O, R, E. Oh, right. Four, four. Four. Oh. 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 oh, unlucky. Let's see what it is. Four. Oh. Oh. Never mind. Perfect. Never mind. It's not going to stop you doing your PhD, is it? No, exactly. they're going to carry on, yeah. yeah. It's not going to stop you getting through your driving test no and getting way. a car, is it? No, no exactly. Didn't quite work out, didn't get the money, but you got to the final, and you know what? You might not be going home with money, but I can say this very confidently. Emmett and Elvira, you do know your lingo. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> That's it for today. Next time, we'll have more teams playing for thousands of pounds. You can join us too, but do you know your lingo?